Testament, there is a scripture in Psalms that says that we are gods in that the, the progenitive life force in us has come from another place in the universe. Wherefore, we are the offspring of the uh, Elohim. We're the offspring of the gods. So we are, in point of God, in point of fact, in a matter of speaking, the offspring of gods. And that being the case, that's why Jesus uh, has Jesus saying to the Hebrews or to the Jews of his day, uh, does not your scripture say that ye are gods, that we are gods? So I'm just saying that uh, when you understand how these words work and what these terms mean, all of a sudden you've got a whole different story than what you thought. Uh, I asked Zachariah Sitchin about that, Planet X, and if it was Nibiru. Mm -hmm. uh, I had him on my show, on my radio show. Uh, but I've talked to him in private, and he, um, he was noncommittal, but he thought it was interesting that this is a, a planet which is legitimately there. It's coming from what I guess from the southern hemisphere, coming from, from the deep south hemisphere, from like uh, over Antarctica, coming this way. So it's not coming from somewhere we can see it, but if you're down in Peru or in the mountains, you can see it coming from the south. We can? Yeah. yeah, so it's, they've already picked, take, taken pictures of it. Uh -huh. uh, so they know it's, it's, it's legitimate. Yes, it's, it's, it is coming this way. Yes, it is, seems to be about twice the size of the Earth. Um, yeah, they're referring to it as Planet X, incidentally. Mm -hmm. and, and what you have to appreciate, too, is that the planet, if it's twice the size of the Earth and comes into our solar system, the uh, David Talbot, I could talk for hours on this subject of the, of the work of David Talbot. Uh, the, the solar system as we know it today is not the same configuration of the solar system that may have existed 10,000 years ago. In other words, Saturn today is just a bright little star. Mm -hmm. Jupiter is a little bit brighter. Well, it's not a star, it's a planet, but it looks like a bright star. But according to the ancient peoples, they said that the configuration of our solar system was totally different. 10,000 to 12, 20,000 years, maybe 25,000 years ago was totally different. Saturn was much closer. Mars was much closer. Uh, different planets were further away. It was a different configuration. So at night, you would walk out and see this huge enormous planet with rings around it, that's how close Saturn was to us. Mm -hmm. And if you take a, a round circle around Saturn and turn it just at a right angle, it looks like an eye. Oh. The eye inside the circle, but the circle is now oblong because you turn the angle and now it looks like an eye looking at you. Mm 